Hello! Ciao! <laughs> Buongiorno, which means good morning yeah. in Italian. <laughs> From Padua, Italy! Woo. So exciting. Come on this side, Celine. So tired. <laughs> yeah. So basically, we're in Padua, Italy right now. Yeah. And we have been driving on a tour bus all night long. What are you what are you showing? Socks. Your socks? Yes. Oh, it's so interesting. I will never wear this in Serbia. Oh, oh, because he's it's wearing forbidden. socks and sandals. Yes. <laughs> but anyways, we've been I'm sorry, sitting, mom, sorry, Dad. We've been driving on a tour bus all night long. We just got here. We're like walking around. It's so pretty. Like I love it so far. It just looks very Italian. I don't know if that makes sense, but it looks very Italian and it's like so clean and so nice and so cute. And even though we literally like slept on a bus last night and we're like I don't know, still half asleep. I'm super happy to be here. Are you? I'm more than half asleep. <laughs> he literally woke up like 10 seconds before we got off the bus. Oh, look at how cute it is. I love it. Oh my gosh, do you love it? I thought we were walking through like this little farmer's market. I love it here. It's like so cute. Like look, there's like just like pretty things everywhere. It's like beautiful bridges, these like pillars, statue things. Like look at all these. And you, my wife, and oh, you. Thank you. You are prettiest thing here. And like all these little like apartments, like they're so cute. I literally can't. Get socks off. <laughs> My coffee. Ah. <laughs> I need my coffee too. We're looking for a market to buy our water because it's really hot already. So hot. Yes, and it's still pretty early. It's 11. <laughs> it's 11? Or maybe 10 in Italy. I don't know the time difference. I don't know. We don't know what time it is in Italy, but... <laughs> but, but we know which day is. Yes, we do know that it's Friday. It's Saturday. Is it? Yes. Oh, it's Saturday, huh? <laughs> um, you heard of this Friday? Yes. <laughs> um, so we're looking for our water bottles, and then we're going to look for like a little coffee shop or like cafe to sit down and drink some coffee. I'm pretty sure we're going to go away. Really? Yes. Uh-oh.
Is it homemade pasta? Confit, they're literally making it right now. I wanna ask. So we stopped at this place that is called... Called Bigoi. Which is Bijoy. Yes, and because they were making um, pasta in the window and we saw them like making this like fresh homemade pasta and we were like, oh my god, we have to go see what this is and then we walked in and it smelled so good and we, so we decided that we had to try it. How is it? Honestly? Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah? Cool. Very good. And it's like a fast food place, but instead of writing fast food, they wrote fast food. But yeah, I'm excited no, to try fast it. food. Hi guys. <laughs> Hello guys. Oh wow. <laughs> Was that the Ita Italian version? I tried. I uh, tried so that. <laughs> How do you feel about the city so far? So far so tired. <gasps> Fuzzy. I'm tired. <laughs> nine o'clock this morning and now it is three o'clock yeah. um it's super super cute here like there are just so many cute little like restaurants and cafes where you can like sit down and eat really bomb italian food like pasta pizza you know the huge um i don't know it's just like so 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 nice like the architecture is so beautiful Oh, authentic American restaurant. Well, that is not what I came here for. You want to eat here? I'm not sure. <laughs> should I eat? I think you should because if, that, if that's what sounds good for it to you, then you should have some. Because we're going to be in Italy for the next like oh, yeah. 12 days. Yeah. So you'll have plenty of opportunities to eat Italian food. We'll let you know if we end up eating there. Oh, they have fried shrimp. Are you excited to try? So much. It looks so good. I don't know how to try this. I don't know, it's really tall. <laughs> Definitely not food for short people. Short guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so hot. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna. Okay, so we're not trying it yet? Okay, so we're gonna try onion rings instead. How is it? Can I have one? Oh, thank you. We are gonna try an onion ring. This place supposedly has authentic American cuisine, so let's put that to the test. I'll let you know how American it is. <laughs> 
Mm. Really good onion rings. So good. We still have to try the burger. But it's like too hot right now, so we have to wait. <laughs> it's also really tall. I'm excited to try. Oh, thank you. <laughs> mm. You're making me hungry. Is it my turn yet? Here it goes. The test from the true American. It's so good. I did not think that we were going to come to Italy and eat cheeseburgers, but I'm really glad we did. <laughs> Just wanted to give you an update on the uh, hamburger. It was amazing. And if you're ever in Padua and you don't feel like eating Italian food because maybe you've just eaten a little bit too much pasta or pizza, then you should definitely come here for some really good burgers or like salads and stuff like that. So good. Good job. We are sitting at this park called Prato de Valle, I believe that's what it's called. Um, it's so beautiful. We just went to like the swap meat slash farmers market. Um, that's like right here to buy this beautiful blanket <laughs> because we didn't want to sit in the grass because we would have gotten all itchy and even took a nap. How's your nap? So good. And he also took his shirt off. taking our final stroll through uh, Padua but I did not expect it to be like this beautiful and like this nice yeah. like I don't know like it's just so beautiful like so clean like I'm so happy and impressed that we ended up stopping. for me it's most important there is no so many tourists so you can like feel Italian spirit yes that's like really nice yeah and that is just like really beautiful I don't know that's pretty much it you can buy pasta everywhere, in every store. But yeah, it's just like so nice and like so Italian. <laughs> he keeps laughing at me because like my description of Italy is that it's so, so Italian. <laughs> but like I feel like that says so much. Oh, cops, cops. We're gonna move. Cops. 
The Popo is here. We have a Range Rover. I mean, we walked a lot today. How much did we walk? Because ten miles. Ten miles. Well, nine point three eight miles we're to be exact, and we're not. We come back yeah, to we're not done yet. Okay, there we go. We we basically walked in the same circle like five times because for some reason we didn't really want to stray away from the yeah, why? circle that we were walking why? in. I was like, let's walk somewhere else where we haven't walked. He's like, no, no, no. It's all like the same thing. Everything is the same. Like, she doesn't know where we are right now. Yes, I do. Did you walk this street? Yes. How many times? Uh, three. Yeah. I don't know. Tomorrow, we are in Naples. Right? Yeah. yeah. And, and if you guys want to visit Italy, definitely come here. Yes. Definitely. definitely make a stop here. That's pretty much all I have to say. The church bells are ringing. 